Hey friends, welcome to a brand new video. Today I have a boohoo haul for you. So if you're interested and you're intrigued to see the bits I picked up from boohoo, you know what to do. Stay tuned. Me love every woman in the world. The girls them pretty like diamonds and pearl. But a one girl me no want. Hello. Welcome back to a brand new video. I am so excited to be back on camera, guys. Honestly, I am so excited. Let me tell you, I have been so under the weather. I have been so unwell for days, and I haven't been able to film for about six days. Um, I overdid it, uh, you know, about seven days ago. And I knew it. I knew I'd overdone it. I'd done a little bit too much than I should have. And I had a massive flare. Like, literally, I haven't had a massive flare like that in so long. Um, yeah, it was bad. It was bad. I was in so much pain. Like, I was so exhausted, fatigued, fog brain. Everything just was psh, 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 hitting me from every direction. Um, and so I basically spent about five, six days in bed. Um, so today is the first day I've managed to like get makeup on um, and film. I am so, so happy to be back, honestly. I didn't think I was going to be able to get this done this week. I thought next week there's going to be no videos because I literally cannot, I cannot get my head out of, I cannot lift my head up. I can't get out of bed I was so so bad so yeah I'm so happy that I am feeling much better my pain is quite low um which can change at any moment I know but um at this present moment I'm feeling happy to be on the camera and to be back doing a video anyways I've been speaking for far too long um if you are new here, you're probably thinking, what the hell is she talking about? Um, I am Jody. Hello, if you are new here, I'm Jodi. Um, and on this channel, I mainly do everything to do with plus size fashion. But as well as plus size fashion, I like to talk about chronic illnesses because I have a few indiv individual invisible illnesses, chronic illnesses, which you can't see from the outside. And I know there are many people that suffer with... Um, disabilities that you cannot see, um, illnesses you can't see. So yeah, I think it's really important to talk about chronic illness and just raise light on it and make people that don't suffer with this condition understand it a little bit more. And people that do suffer with the conditions that I suffer with or similar um, conditions, make them feel less alone. Let them know that there are other people like myself um, that also go through what they're going through. So I think it's really important to talk about these issues because I once used to keep it all to myself. I used to feel very ashamed because I used to think people wouldn't understand me. I've got makeup on. I've, I'm dressed nice. People won't understand that I'm really unwell. So, you know, I've let that go over my head now. And, you know, I, I'm diagnosed and I have these illnesses. I take a lot of medication just to be here so I'm going to talk about it and I'm going to raise awareness where I can um and also I'm a mum of I've got two boys so I love to vlog every once in a while so you'll probably see their little little faces in a video here and there so a little bit of lifestyle on this channel and also I love hair and makeup and beauty. So there'll also be some beauty on this channel as well. Um, if that sounds like a channel you would like to be part of, I've just done the longest rundown, um, then please do subscribe. I would love to have you. And um, don't forget to hit the notification bell because that will notify you every time I upload a new video. And at the end of this video, if you do like it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It really does help me out. It helps me know that you guys are enjoying the content that I'm putting out and it also helps the algorithms um of my channel so yeah um so today i'm back with a boohoo haul this was highly requested by you guys i had quite a few women reach out and say can you do a boohoo haul next so sure of course i can so i ordered a few bits um purely for you guys i know i'll end up probably keeping one or two things hopefully just one or two and the rest will go back um so yeah i will link all of the items down in the description box and also what else i'm a uk size 24 slash 26 depends where i get the items from in boohoo probably all i'll order all 
more or less in a 26, some may be in a 24, but I will let you know on the screen as I'm showing the item. Um, I'm five foot ten and a half, five foot eleven, probably six foot with this big old hair. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. Anyways, let me stop talking and let's get into this haul. So friends, I just thought I'd show you this dress again if you were wondering what is she wearing. I'm wearing this really lovely dress that I got from my last ASOS haul. I honestly could not send this back. I absolutely love it. Um, I have this in black and that was the reason why I reordered it because I see it in this colour just to do a haul and show you guys. And when I put it on, I was like, oh my God, I absolutely love this colour. So yeah, this dress is from um, ASOS and I will link it down in the description box down below. Let me show you the back. This is the back, really nice little tie up. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing now, but let's get into some Boohoo clothes and let me show you the first item. I have this really lovely like Bardo, um, Bardo dress and oh my God, I absolutely love this. I love the colour. Um, the colour of this dress is everything. It's like a kind of like a beige colour. Um, I'm wearing this in a UK 24, um, the sizing's fine. Um, I find kind of like Boohoo with their maxi dresses, depending on the shape of the dress, um, you have to kind of size up or size down, um, or like, because I've been doing this for a while now, I kind of know what will fit me in my size with Boohoo and what I need to size up. And I kind of knew that this would fit me in my size because I have, um, I think I have two other Boohoo dresses, which I purchased a couple years back, which are like this. Um, and yeah, I went for my normal, no, I think I went for a size bigger and I had to send it back because it was too big. So yes, yeah, so I went for this size and this size is perfect. It's absolutely adorable, guys. Um, as you can see, it's kind of like a wrap style at the front here. And you've got kind of like this opening. That's what it is like on the model on the um, on their website. The material is quite, I don't know if it's see-through. I don't know if you can see my pants underneath. Um, it's quite sheer, but really nice for summer. You don't feel like you're going to overheat in it or anything like that if the sun decides to make... An appearance because right now we haven't had much sun at all and normally in May there is sunshine so I'm hoping for shiny days because I have so many dresses that I want to wear um, and this one may be a keeper as well I think I may just need to keep it um, let me come a bit closer so I can show you a little bit closer up um, so it's got this really nice um, frill detail at the top here. Can you see how pretty is that? And then some frill detail here. Um, and then you've got this, um, is it called sheared? 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 I don't know. I've just tucked my bra straps down, but you would need to wear strapless bra. Or you can just pop, pop your bra straps down if you like. I don't know. Whatever suits you. Um, and yeah, I really like this. It's absolutely beautiful. I just love a flowery dress. I love a flowery dress. And this one is just oh, adorable. So it gets a 100 thumbs up from me. I'm talking loads today because I'm so excited to be back on the screen and in a beautiful dress. Oh my God, you guys are going to die with me today. <laughs> Okay, friends, so next up, we have this really lovely sort of colourful dress. Um, I'm wearing it in a size 26. I could definitely have just got my original size as a 24. It's slightly large, but it fits. It's absolutely fine. Um, it's a really lovely colour. Like, look at the colours. Um, I'm not quite sure if the shoulders are meant to be up or down, but I think I prefer them sort of sitting down like that. Um it's like a lovely blue colour, like a pastel, darkishy blue colour um, with all of these like little pink flowers all over them. Um, and then you've got these kind of, I don't know, they like milkmaid um, sleeves. I don't know if that's what they're called. And then you have that sheared uh, bit here. Um, and then you've just got a nice skirt bit at the bottom here, which is absolutely has it got a little slit? 
yeah and also you've got a little slit there so that's nice um loads and loads of room at this size i'd definitely say just go for your original size if you're thinking about you know sizing wise because i know boohoo can be really funny with sizes so with this i would just say go for your original size um and yeah really nice it's like lightweight lovely for the summer um let me show you the back So that's the back. I really do like this. It's a lovely colour. Um, real nice dress. A nice pop of colour for the summer. So definitely gets a thumbs up from me. Okay, so next up we have this kind of like bardo um, dress. Now, this is what I'm saying with their sizing. They can be, it can be so hit and miss. I'm not quite sure what size this is. I can't see the tag at the back. But I think I may have got this in a 26 or it might be a 24. I don't know. I'll put it on the screen. But this is like, I mean, it's okay. But I'd like it to be looser on my tummy area. Um, so, because you can kind of see my tummy. And I don't really want to see my tummy. I want it to sort of just flow down. I don't want it to be like clingy to me. These dresses, you in the summer, you don't want the dress to be clingy you want them to be loose and you want to feel free you want to feel like relaxed um that's me anyway in the summer i don't really want things to be clinging to me i want i want that room for the air to flow around me and this just feels a little bit tight um so yeah it's just like a plain vado it this bit here just feels too small for my boobs as well i just thought this would be like a real nice look with you know just some like sandals or just some pumps and a little jean jacket over the top if it got a little bit cold or a little cardigan it's just a nice throw on dress this would be nice sort of like in the summer you just can feel a little bit free um the sun can hit you on your shoulders without ha without having any line marks and if it does get a bit chilly you could put like a little cardigan or um a jean jacket over the top or whatever but yeah i just feel like this just all in all just feels too small for me like this feels like it needs to be a little bit longer this sheer bit feels like it needs to be a bit bigger it just feels like it's not right um i did order this in a in a red as well i'm gonna try the red on because i was really excited to try this in the red um but yeah it's just too it's just too clingy for my liking so thumbs down and so this is the red one and actually i like the red one more than i like the gray one but it still does feel like it's not fitting me right this boob area just feels um like it should be larger like my boobs are not sort of comfortable in this bit this bando bit at the top here which is annoying um but i love the red i love red um and one thing i do love about boohoo um is their their maxi dresses are maxi dresses for me um with a lot of other brands the dresses are not maxi dresses they they come up slightly because i'm quite tall um so that's one thing i do like about boohoo is that whenever i order a maxi dress it really truly is a maxi dress and it does hit me right down to my ankles um so the length of this is beautiful this one doesn't feel like it's fitting me as snug as the other one this is a size 24 so i'm not quite sure what size that one was it, i would have put it on the screen um but yeah i do really like this but I was just thinking, I do actually own a red bardo dress like this, so I don't need to keep this one anyway. But just bear in mind that if you are looking for a bardo dress like this, it is really nice. This material feels lovely. But if you are bigger busted like me, just keep in mind that this sheared bit kind of doesn't feel like it's big enough. It, I almost feel like it needed to be brought down a little bit longer so it kind of is sort of hugging your boobs and doesn't feel like it's just sitting above and that's how it feels at the moment. It feels like it's sitting above. Um, but yeah, I do like this one much better than I like the grey. Um, let me know, what do you think? Do you prefer this one or the grey one or you don't like them or do you like them? I don't know, let me know. Um, but I'm going to give this one a thumbs up but purely because the length is perfect and the colour is perfect. It's just this sheer bit that is just a bit of a pain for me. But that's just because I have got slightly larger bust. Um, so yeah, but all in all, I love it. It's a really nice dress. It feels really comfortable. Show you the back. Yeah. 
have this jumpsuit and it uh, I don't know why like why do I have such problems with jumpsuits this is not long enough for me in the torso um it's really hurting the shoulders um it's not long enough so it's really pulling when I pulled it over my shoulders um it's it felt like it's pull, pulling my shoulders down because it's not um, got enough material for my torso um I, however i did um i did size up for this jumpsuit i ordered it in a size 28 i always size up loads for jumpsuits because i have a larger tummy and i don't like it to kind of cling anywhere um be too clingy but yeah this for me just feels just really cheap like cheaply made the pockets are tiny this isn't real it's just yeah just not for, i don't think it's good value for money to be honest um i'm very short in the body i need to pull these down because that is painful um so yeah if you're taller in the body like me this is not gonna work for you um so yeah i don't know not for me it's kind of like a rib material i like the material though i like the rib material and I like the fact that they're cuffed at the bottom. Don't know if you can see that at the bottom. They're cuffed and they're quite tight, so I like that. Um, but yeah, it's just so it fit me right. Let me show you the back. The back, it's literally pulling me to pieces. So I'm gonna take it off because it doesn't feel right. So on to the next. Next up, we have this really pretty like lemon tiered long tiered dress it's a maxi dress um it's a bar dot a bar do, bar dot or whatever you call it um and i didn't think i'd like it because of like the tearing i'm kind of funny with the tearing but if you remember my asos haul i tried a white dress on which had tearing which i kept i loved it um so i thought i'd try this as well um so yeah it's a long maxi dress you can see my underwear through this it's the only thing you probably have to wear white i've got black underwear on it is really nice it kind of feels like cotton like a bit of cotton sort of linen might be a bit of both um although the the arms feel a little bit snug they feel a little bit tight um and i wouldn't say i have like extremely big arms so um if you're kind of top heavy here bear that in mind because can you see that's kind of digging in um it feels a bit uncomfortable you've got this little sort of string here which you can make a better bow if you like and then you've got this detailing underneath the bust there um and then it's like tearing at the bottom so yeah um I don't know how I feel about this. I'm not quite sure. You guys are going to have to let me know. Um, I love the colour. I know that. I think the colour is really, really pretty. Um, but, yeah, I'm just not sure on the actual style of the dress itself. So, yeah. Next, we have this dress. Let me just move my hair out of the way. Um, next, we have this dress. And I really like this dress. I think I like this dress more than the first dress that I tried on purely just because the first dress I really liked but I do have similar dresses like that but this one I don't have anything like this with kind of like let me come a bit closer so you guys can see um it's got like these ru little rustly sort of pretty little um straps um and it's kind of like I don't know you can see the pattern there the flowery sort of pattern i really like this dress it's really nice um it's wrapped right at the front so you've got a little bit of a peep little bit of a you know leg showing if you want to it's maxi like long at the back if you can see it's touching all the way down to the ground um it's nice and long at the back and then sort of comes up all oh, but you'd probably want to wear maybe some cycling shorts under this just in case it kind of whoo if it's a bit windy but yeah i really like this this is so nice this, i don't have a dress like this which 
maybe want me to maybe it's maybe making me want to keep this one because i don't have a dress like it um but yeah i really like this it's nice and um material feels nice and airy nice and free um it's got that sheared bit at the top here which i love nice and comfy and as you can see it's nice and long so it comes sort of like right over my boobs and sort of cinches you in at the waist there so yeah really like this so definitely a thumbs up from me we have this dress which is too tight for me i just need it to be ugh, get your words out jode i would need it to be a little bit looser um but i never knew that this dress had the biggest slit up the side guys what is this about who is going to go out with that i'm sorry but that is way too high um however this is a really nice dress it's got a lovely print um yeah i love the reds i love the little white flowers over it but yeah it's just too snug and that slit up the side ugh, i would not be doing that so yeah it's a nice material just a nice stretchy jersey material i love the v-neck on it love the little straps um i love the red and the little flowers but yeah that that slit at the side guys that's that is that's that's naughty so this one gets a thumbs down from me i have this really pretty top I really like this. I think it's really, really nice. Paired with jeans like this, I think it looks lovely. Um, it's kind of like a, is it called a peplum style top? Um, let me come a little bit closer so you can see the print, which will cut my head off. Um, so yeah, it's like a kind of like beigey colour with sort of these sort of um, little mustardy flowers, pink flowers, lilac flowers. Really like this. I'm not normally a fan of around neck either you know what i'm like guys um but i really like this i think it's really pretty and i like the back let me show you the back so i really like this detailing up here i think it's a really nice top i haven't shown you the top in ages have i guys i've just been showing you all these dresses um and i'm i've been loving trying dresses on because summertime I don't really like to wear jeans too much in summer but if it's a little bit cold um a little bit not so hot and then i don't mind putting some jeans on and a nice pretty little top like this with some sandals so yeah really like this i think i'm gonna keep i think this is gonna be a keeper i think this is a really pretty top um so yeah definitely gets a thumbs up from me okay friends so next we have another cute little top um, so these tops are slightly on the shorter side so if you're kind of like a tall gal like me just keep that in mind um, but they're not too short where I feel overly conscious about them being up here and all my tummies on show um, I am totally 100% comfortable in my own skin but when I say to you guys I want a top to cover my tummy that's just because it's my preference and that's just how I like to dress I love it when I see girls tucking their tops in, living their best life, wearing their clothes, you know, with the French tuck. I love that. It looks lovely on some people. But just for me, I'm just the kind of girl that just likes to have a top flowing over my tummy. Um, so, yeah, I always go for, you know, a top that is sort of long enough so it gives me that coverage. I just think that it suits me best. Um, so yeah, so just keep in mind that these two tops, this one and the one I showed you before, are slightly on the short side if you are sort of longer like me, but I don't feel like they're too short that it's a problem. So yeah, um, this however is, it's a lovely print, I like the print, I like the fact that you've got these sleeves that you can adjust and do little, do your, um, little bows, I think that adds a little extra touch to the top um but as you can see you can see all of my bra i couldn't go braless um and i think that even if i wore maybe if i wore a boob tube a boob tube a strapless bra not a boob tube if i wore a strapless bra maybe that yeah i think i'd have to wear strap obviously yeah because of the um 
these that are so thin so yeah if i wore a strapless bra i think then i wouldn't have a problem with seeing all of this um and yeah i think the sides would be fine so yeah actually this top is really nice i really do like the colors like you've got like the mint greens here the um pinks and um the yellows just really nice a really nice summery top um so yes yeah, so i'll give this one a thumbs up as well friends so this however is a feel too small for me um it just doesn't fit right i had lovely plans for this top i thought oh it's really pretty i love a, a nice white um top for the summer um and it is a really nice top but it's just i don't know it just doesn't feel like it fits me properly um it's got this really lovely um detailing across the bust area here um it's nice and a v a v neck um it's quite it's quite um booby so if you're not really a person that likes that then this probably isn't for you um i think that this is not too bad uh with a white bra the sleeves i've got like a nice bit of stretching up here and then you've also got um a bit of stretching up here but again i'm having that problem it's it feels tight on my on the sleeves um so yeah i'm not sure why that is because yeah i don't i don't consider that i've got you know i don't really know they're just doing these a little bit too tight personally um but yeah i do like this i just maybe maybe i needed to size up but i think this was the only size i think this was the largest size they did i think maybe that's why i got it in this size i don't know um but yeah I do like it again it is shorter but I don't know I feel like I feel like it it's not too short I feel like it's okay but I just feel like it looks too small on me it needs to be a bit more flowy it needs to like I don't know if you know what I'm talking about but I feel like this top needs to have a bit more flow to it so yes yeah, so I feel like this is too small for me but it is a really nice top so I'm going to give it a thumbs up but it's just a thumbs down for me it's just not working for me so so friends that is the end of my boohoo haul i really hope you enjoyed it i've reverted to putting my hair up in a bun just because it was getting on my nerves um so yeah i really enjoy trying the bits on i loved a couple of the dresses and i really like that top with the crisscross thing at the back i really like that i thought it was really nice it's been a while since i kind of tried tops on for you isn't it um but oh, I, actually, I did try some tops on it in my yours clothing haul. I just feel like I've tried a hell of a load of dresses on for you. But what do we wear in summer? We love we love dresses. I love dresses in summer. Um, and believe it or not, I only started wearing dresses probably about four years ago. Um, before that, I would never wear a dress. So no, probably probably about five years ago. So yeah, I now I love wearing dresses. Um, let me know what your favourite item was. I'd love to hear from you guys. Comment down below. And remember, if you haven't subscribed already, I would love it if you become part of my YouTube family. It costs absolutely nothing. All you need to do is hit that subscribe button. I'm really trying to get to 10k by the end of the year. So it would be really nice if you would uh, join my YouTube family and become part of the family. Did I say that already? I said that how many times? Ugh, I'm going crazy. Um, oh, Jodie. So if you have any other brands that you'd like to see me do, please let me know. I'd love to hear what brands you'd like to see because I kind of do stick to the brands that I like and I know that are, you know, good brands and I wouldn't show you guys anything that I don't kind of wear or buy myself. So, yeah, if there are any brands that you'd kind of like wanting to check out and you haven't tried them before but you'd like me to try first, I don't mind doing that. So, hit me up, let me know what you would like to see and hopefully I can bring that to you guys. Um, but, yeah, I've left all of the items that I've shown you today in this haul down in my description box and, um yeah i hope you all enjoyed today's haul and i will definitely see you all in my next haul take care of yourself and god bless to you all Mwah. bye guys